Budget cuts and fewer teachers mean more desks and students in Vigo County classrooms this year. Good evening. I'm Patrice Dayton. And I'm Mark Allen. School Superintendent Danny Tanus tells News 10 class sizes will be larger this year. This comes after the Vigo County School Corporation offered early retirement to teachers and staff as a way to cut costs. News 10's Louisa Muller joins us live in the newsroom with the very latest. Louisa? Mark Patrice, we've known it was a possibility, but now it's been confirmed by the Vigo County Superintendent. The number of kids in each classroom will be higher this year than it has been in years past. So News 10 took that information and we put it on Facebook to get your opinion. Stacy says, I'm totally against making class sizes larger. Teachers are already spread too thin to give children one-on-one -on -one attention when they need it. Jennifer, a Vigo County teacher, says, although VCSE is struggling, just like every other school corporation in the state, it is looking better academically and financially than most other corporations. Now the school corporation says it all stems back to budget cuts. The Vigo County School Corporation lost $5 million in state funding this year. To help cut the budget, employees were offered early retirement or a buyout package. About 85 teachers took the buyout, 10 administrators, and a handful of employees left for other reasons. It looks like we probably will not replace about 50 of those positions, so uh, we'll probably have 50 less teachers in the classrooms next year. Uh, so we'll have larger class size, uh, but that's better than having layoff people. Danny Tanu says no new teachers have been hired yet, but many temporary teachers from last year are being placed. And if you didn't already know, school starts August 17th. Reporting live in the newsroom, Louisa Moeller, News 10. Patrice, back to you. Thank you very much, Louisa. School officials say they will not know how large classes will be until school is back in session.